I'll be right with you. You don't need to check if I'm doing it right. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. I like Sadie, not lady. I know. Yeah. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see? Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair making cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and know nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Please. Hey there! Hey. What, uh, what you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lemoyne Raider country. Keep it cool, You sweet. need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Go, go, go! Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Go! here. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Careful, we show those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. Did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Hey, slow down. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe, if he asks. But, maybe not. So who did they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? Anyway, don't you go ribbing Pierce about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. Won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind is bottles. 
Not a chance. Arthur, what the hell? Self-killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but... I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Oh, shut up.